So it's called La Peste. And with purple brush shall I trace fate's hideous grimace. And then an empty beer can gets you five cents back. The limousine to Stephen Critchlow's burial cost me $150. $50 deposit, no return. Was it? No, he died of natural, of natural causes. Innocent as a lamb. We are born innocent as lamb, and wouldn't it be nice to die that way? On the other hand, he died of faggot, of a faggot disease. Huh. It has happened. Mm. No. Stephen Critchlow died of natural causes, and my dad? Will it be a black tie affair of the heart break? How will you die, faggot? Yes, she died with a dick up her ass. Poor thing, really. Knocking back if the can is dented. Poor thing. And what will I get back? Oh, I'll take the nickel now. Thank you very much. Oh, 6 a.m. Church bells ring out my window. I've counted them so often. 23 damn clans. How many boys have said, what the hell is that? I live right across the street um, from the church. Um, I look at a painting by Futura 2000, 2000, 2001, Lenny. Just what happens now as the sun rises over Manhattan, remember that story I told you about the ivory boy in the blue moonlight? And remember that other story and the other? The sun is rising over the Metropolitan Museum of Art. Small families. Small families. Parked cars. And bacteria. <laughs> Are we? Are we just bacteria pululating in swarms over this planet? Looks that way. <laughs> I lived for love. God, what are you doing? I lived for love and always had the most beautiful lovers. What was I without that? Ah, oh, love, how I lay in its embrace and woke to stare at its toothless face. If you, if you can't smell pussy on it, put it in your mouth. <laughs> Love can be eternal, no return, if you know what I mean. So he said uh, to Klaus, know me, I'll love you till the day you die, and he meant it. <laughs> Death can be gay, and the musical comedy about Crispo featuring the hit song, One Night Only. <laughs> Would you <laughs> <death be gay? laughs> Burned to a crisp Or a slow, lingering sort of death from any virus that comes down the pipe? Each man kills the thing he loves. La la la. La la la. la, la. <laughs> <laughs> When I died, the stars will crash together like a thousand glass bells. Birds will tear their eyes out, rending heaven's fabric with their shrieks. Maybe collapse on the sidewalk incognito. After all, I lived for love. And uh, to further a point, die for it too? Question mark. I loved, I lived for love and played its game, drenching myself <coughs> in its mist like sprays of French perfume, how I lay in its embrace. I would die for you. And so is love just a word you hear in a song and old 60s idea that can only steer you wrong.
other background. <laughs> <laughs> so, flee this invisible fire, licking, licking imperceptibly at my heels. Go someplace where the boys uh, don't have it. Avenue D. <laughs> the Bronx. <laughs> or perhaps more innocent terrain, Nepal, Tunisia, where unbeknownst you'll carry it so it can spread there like wildfire. <laughs> oh, you're from New York. Sorry, I'm busy for the next few years. <laughs> I lived for love, know every move. The subtle art, past master am I. Every trick in the book, the book of love, I wrote it out of print. <laughs> <laughs> Yet, the pages are on fire, the board thrown off the table, the game not worth the candle, and it's the wrong game with the wrong chips. <laughs> Delories. Excuse me, there are pages to be turned over, and I have <laughs> <laughs> September 22nd, first day of August, a lovely day, a lovely day, people would stop talking. <laughs> if, the if the invisible worm should sick this rose today, OD on junk, check in under an assumed name into Beth Israel, or Rock Hudson-like, out of the closet, into intensive care, <laughs> in the limelight's red glare, good night America. Who wants to die queer? And they always said Rock Hudson had the dick of death. <laughs> <laughs> Stephen Critchlow died alone at 29 of a massive heart attack. He was loved, but it didn't kill him. I want to go to sleep. I'm going to sleep. I'll wake up tomorrow. And tomorrow? Love me? Till I die? Really? September 22nd, 1985. Yay! Yay.